What's wrong, Nikki? You all right? I'm just feeling a bit lightheaded because I've been trying to deal with this gargantua on my chin. What you got on your chin? Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, God. I had a zip that really cramped my style for a bit. It's ruining my whole life. Are you putting hydrogen peroxide on it, Nikki? Yeah. It'll shrink it. Nikki, mm. I have some good, like, I got, like, proactive zip cream if you want it. Really? Yeah. For this fall? Yeah. Serious. Here, you can take that off and read about it if you want, but oh. it's, it works really good. Kelsey, thank you so much. And if you want to use my face wash or anything, like, it's also proactive, it's up there. Oh, thank you. You're welcome, Di. This made me feel quite unwell. Mm. And lightheaded and sick and it's really bad. What are you looking at? So you shouldn't squeeze it. You should not squeeze them. You should squeeze it if you've got clean fingers. Yeah. But you shouldn't squeeze it to the point of bleeding. Well, and you should wait. You should wait until like you have to. Like if you try and force it, then it gets worse. Yeah. She'd already picked at it. Well, it was an open wound, but I could still see a white. It was skin. Well, if I had a with my hands slowly went like that, I would have seen that. I do it with this. You need to be able to touch it to feel whether there is pressure there of something still in there. Squeezing a good zit's fun. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but you can't from sight. But I did it good and then I listened to you and now it's bad. You should. But that's because you wouldn't let me touch it and I might have gone, oh yeah, no, there is nothing in there. From sight, it looked like there was still a white pustule in there. Oh. It's I had a zit on this show that ruined my life. It ruins Ooh. your life. It literally ruined my life. I like wasn't the same for like five days. What? A pimple. What? Just it don't your get life? infected. Just don't get infected and it will heal within a day. It ruined my life. No, it was, this was like the biggest pimple I've ever had in my life. And did you leave it? No, she covered up with makeup constantly so I couldn't breathe. Yeah, that's a problem. I was it in the here, Kelsey? Television. Huh? In here? In this house. I don't remember that. Oh my God, it was like... The... It wasn't that bad for everyone. No, I had it... one on the end of my nose for about a week. It was fine. I just got all the pus out of it. And just kept just like, use, Nikki, use as much it. as my face wash as you want. It's Thank proactive you, too. And then... Can I just explain what happened? Please I've do. I've been putting the treatment on for the past three days. This will heal within a day as long as it's not infected. Yes, I know, but it was it was perfectly fine. I had it under Have control. Have I touched your face? No, no you could have told me to shut up and go away. No, but can I just finish? I had it all under control with the spot treatment I was using. And then I thought, right, I'm gonna listen. I can't walk around with a pustule on my face any longer on TV. Ugh. So I... So you don't. So no. there's redness around yes. it, but that's just because you've pushed a bit. The no, redness no, will go no, down no, within an hour. No, no, I didn't push. I took <laughs> off the top, just just scraped she, off the top. You don't do that. You do not do that. I never told you to scrape the top off. No, with a tool. You I do used not do that. Tool. You don't cut the skin. I said that is the danger. But I didn't cut the skin. I took the top. I just. I've done it before and it works. And I just scraped off the top, out came a ball, and that was fine. Good. And you it was didn't still tell raised. Me that out came a ball. Then you should have left it. it. I know. It was still raised, and I came and showed Tim. I said, Look, there's a hole. She did not tell me that out came a ball. I thought the ball was still in there. I could see a white thing still in it there. Was it was skin. Well, it she was didn't... skin. So then I go back and I squeeze and squeeze until my eyes are Wouldn't watering have done that. and I'm hyperventilating I and I feel <laughs> sick and now I've made it a hundred times worse. Exactly. Darling, put this, and I would not put have done that. Put the spot treatment I gave I'm you on it for like ten minutes. That, up, that you didn't do what I said. Oh God. 
and now I feel really sick and traumatised. You should, because he didn't do what I said to do. Yes, but I shouldn't have listened to you in the first place because if what did I'd you have, listen to? I came and showed you, that and you first told part me was what I what I said for you to do. You did that. What you then did was on your own accord. You squeezed and squeezed and squeezed until you hyperventilated. That is absolutely not what you do. No, but you tried to do <laughs> you it to me. You squeezed till blood came out. <laughs> I, if I, I didn't... didn't try to do it to you, you wouldn't let me touch it. If I had That's a touch, I would have been able to go. Oh, there is nothing left in there. Leave it. I don't know what you went and did and squeezed and squeezed and squeezed till you were hyperventilating and blood was coming out your face. <laughs> I never told you to do that. I never told you to do that. <laughs> Nikki, it, 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 I know what you feel, what it feels like, though. It literally will ruin your life for yeah. the next couple of days. But just oh I God. will not. Let's, do not say that. Don't. It will be fine by tonight. As long as you keep the well, wound Well, I'm just going to hold this stick. Well, and like by you saying that it's been there for a couple of days, I never noticed it. it took, like now I will because you pointed it out, but I never noticed Keep it. Keep the wound clean. As soon as it stops bleeding and you'll get the plasma, the crusty plasma, mm -hmm. just wipe that off and it won't be bleeding anymore. The swelling will go down. As long as the wound is kept clean and doesn't get infected, it'll be healed by the morning. If you didn't pop the white head, you'd still have a white head in the morning. The risk now is that you've got an open wound on your face that could get infected, which will then take longer to heal. It's just speeding up the process of getting rid of the pus from the pimple. But most people could, like, make it worse by infecting the wound that they create on their face. And when you squeeze blood out, that's too far. You've gone too far.